Okay, right. Um, okay. Okay, I'm gonna get straight to the point. So, I'm a videographer, um, and last week I attended a car boot sale, which was happening nearby. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's a place uh, where people sell all their unwanted stuff uh, and just yeah, just shit they don't want basically. And um, I bought this uh, this camcorder and a really nice camera uh, for cheap, very cheap, basically nothing. I bring them home. Surprise, surprise, they don't work. They don't even turn on. But I check the both ports for SD cards. And surprisingly, there was an SD card in each. So, I check my MacBook to see if there's any footage, which shouldn't be the case. But, the last thing I expected to see was found footage of two, two boys from my local area who have been missing. I've watched the whole thing, and I can say it's very disturbing, so... I don't know how long this will be on YouTube for. It'll probably get taken down. So these these two lads, they were um, they were out making a documentary on an urban legend um, in this local area, and I think they got too passionate, and I think this might be proof that this this mythical creature is real. I've made like a rough cut um, for you guys to watch. This is 100% real, like this is real fan footage guys. I've decided to call this uh, documentary Lurking and you'll find out why in a moment. I think that's all there is to say really, um, no, there's nothing else. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm just going to let you guys watch it now. I'll talk about it afterwards, it make more sense if I talk about it afterwards. Um, yeah, that's it. Hey, uh, John, what the fuck are you doing? No, no yeah, sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm up here. Yeah, I give him, give him a minute. Yeah? You good? Yeah, yeah, Focused, yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Come on, Kurt. You got this. Hey, I'm Kurt Duplass with Video Production News, a professional news gathering service. Yeah, you know, make sure you get the topic, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I made this my fucking self. Anyway, today we're doing something very interesting and exciting. Oh, we're finding the goat man. Now, what is the goat man, you ask? Well, the goat man, if you live in the town of Gosmore, you'll know exactly what the goat man is, the, especially the tail of the goat man. He's a seven foot, half man, half goat. It, it's just insane. He even wields a fucking axe. A fucking axe, John. Who who wields an axe in a, in a woods? A lumberjack. I mean, look at the woods. Did you just, did you just say a lumberjack? I mean, you're not, you're not wrong, but... Uh, yeah, carry on. Anyway, carry on. yeah. Oh. Let me stop you. So, uh, the, the most important thing about the gold man is his height. Seven foot. I know I've already said that, but I gotta emphasize it. Because if I don't emphasize it, you won't understand how tall. I mean, John, what are you, like 5'8? Yeah, or, or, or something like that, I don't know. I mean, you look about 5'6, but I'll give you 5'8. Now, he's been around since the 1900s, and the sightings still occur today. Um, you know, like especially last year, I think it was a, a heightened uh, record for uh, hunters and hikers going missing. So that was pretty interesting. Um, local people are terrified of him. Literally, I tried to in interview this old woman, and she just wouldn't have any of it. Seriously, I had to just walk away. We, didn't we, John? Like, we yeah. Do yeah I mean, she was like 80, so you probably scared the hell out of her. But, but you know. I mean, come on. If I'm 80 and I can't talk about the goat man, like the local myth, then. What am I going to do? Just sit and play bingo all day? Like, I mean, she's probably quite happy doing that. Okay, we're, we're going very off track. I, I need to like reel it back in. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. He's got a uh, hooved feet. 
which is quite interesting. You know, footprints. If we can find footprints, that'd be fucking interesting, Dylan. That'd be really fucking Leave it be him or a deer. You never know. If it's a deer, then I'm very disappointed. Uh, where's my phone, John? I get, I show the picture. Hang on, John. Give me two seconds. So uh, this is the goat man. As you can see, uh, he's got. I mean, that, they're massive horns. You know, massive. Uh, the ears are quite big. It looks like an elf. You know, like Lord of the Rings. You seen? You seen Lord of the Rings? I, I've seen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, maybe. Yeah. I, I mean, I that's don't... the best film franchise of all fucking time. Sure, carry on. Yeah. Anyway, so he's got uh, glowing dark empty eyes, uh, which is said to, if you look straight into them, he will possess you. I mean, that that's terrifying. Um, as you can see, he actually does have the hooped feet in this picture as well. This is actually the most like infamous, famous picture of all time of the goat man. If we capture anything like this today, I mean, I will be very, very excited. I'm, no, we could literally be on the front page of the local newspaper. We'll be heroes. We're on TV. Anyway, to, uh, little sum up this uh, documentary. I guess we can call it a documentary. Yeah, yeah. Um, we'll be visiting locations of uh, the Goat Man, you know, where the most sightings have been seen. And um, I'll give you a little bit more facts about the abilities, uh, some more tale folk uh, about the Goat Man himself, you know, his uh, origins, which is very interesting, in my Um... But I think for now, I think that's it. I think we should just move on to just heading up, upwards and onwards, you know? Sure. Let's go. If you say so. <laughs> Give me a minute. Come on. Yeah, yeah, sorry. This documentary's not going to film, so... If only it would, then I wouldn't have to be here. What was that, sorry? Nothing, nothing. Carry on. I should probably talk about, uh, you know, what we're actually doing today. Without walking into a bush. That would be very helpful. Um, oh my god, everything. Uh, so we're actually going to be visiting some of the locations of the gold man. You know, the most occasional sightings you see. Um, this includes, you know, like a bridge on underpass. Um, and wooded areas are very big hotspots for uh, the gold man being sighted. What is it? What the hell is that? No idea. Let's have a pretty little look. Oh no! It's a balloon. <laughs> I, I, I... We missed the Goatman's birthday party. Come on, Giant, it's not time to be. Alright, alright, sorry, Come sorry. Come on, we've got to focus now on track, yeah? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm right, fine. Let's start this again. Hey, uh, excuse me, John. The money shot's up here, not down there, on that piece of shit. No, I thought it was pretty cool as a tire. Anyway, yeah. Come on, we gotta go. Let's just go. So, I wanna move on to the uh, the origins of the gold man, which are very interesting. There's two main conspiracy theories, which, I mean, I don't like using the word conspiracy theories, but, you know, that's what they say online. So the first one is uh, a scientist who experimented on uh, goats, maybe lambs. Uh, actually, one of his very last uh, science experience backfired on you know, uh, it turned him into a half man, a half goat. Obviously, the bottom half being the goat and the top half being a man. So, Real smart of him doing that. I mean, he calls himself a scientist. Like, come on. The second, and I mean, it, it's not even like a conspiracy theory. I think it's genuinely just true, uh, which is the goat man is a purely demonic creature from the devil himself. It's a bit like, you know, uh, Noah's Ark, you know, too many hatred people in this world. You need a demonic creature to put people in balance and check this. This town has like a kind of vibe from that I don't really fuck with, you know? So you're saying that this goat man was sent like a plague to kill people? I mean, pretty much. I mean, it's better than sending like John Wick to do the job or something. I mean, yeah, I guess this is a bit more terrifying. As you can see, some of the town down there. Look at all those fuckers. Yeah, Gomez going to get you bitches. Anyway, let's go up here, John. Come on. Yes, yeah, sorry. I think you're getting a bit too passionate about this. Yeah, I mean, I've, I've done my research on this. Trust me, I know much more than, a, you know, the average human. So, the last thing I want to talk about is how the goat man has changed this town. You know, like I said, this town's very spoiled. It's like a plague, you know. You have all these thieves, you know, these homeless. And I'm... 
I just don't understand how people don't believe in the goat man, you know? They think he's just a myth. Just something that lurks in the woods, you know? Why are they so scared to go up there? You know what I mean? I'm not scared. You're not scared, are you, John? Uh, I, I, I don't care anymore. I, yeah, I just kind of want to go home. If any of you are watching out this, don't be like John. Be like me. Kurt Duplass. You know, VPN. You, know, you can go to our website. I sell this merch. Like I said, I made this myself. It's pretty cool. You can get it in blue, white, gold. You can even get it in pink. I don't know if you like guys like pink. I like pink. It's pretty cool. So, John, we still gotta walk a, a fucking mile and a half. Uh, and I'm out of fucking breath already. Alright, well, let's get to it, I guess. I have piss as well. You know? Do you need toilets around and just, you know, tap me on the shoulder? Uh. I mean, you know, some people do say trees are a bit like toilets, you know? Nature's toilet. Yes, exactly. I mean, if you if, if you want to shit, John, you can just dig a hole and bury it, you know? That should be fine. I mean, no judgment here by me. No, by all means. I feel like we've gone off the rails a little bit here. This was all about Goatman and now... I know, but like, what the fuck am I supposed to talk about Goatman here? Like, should I just make... John, I can make something tough. John. No, I thought this was a documentary. Hey, John, you know, just put the camera down. Okay. Just, what if I make up some random shit about Goatman or something interesting? Like, what if I say, like... I mean, this is your documentary. You can do what you like. I'm just here for the ride. You know what's really disgusting, John? No. Deforestation. It's horrible. I mean, just look over there. I, I don't understand how people do this. Do you know why there's so much deforestation over there, John? Uh, no again. The reason why is because the locals, the locals, the fucking Gosmore locals, have been chopping trees down to expose the gold man. Because, you know, the police, they can't do fuck all that because, I mean, it's a mythical creature. What are you going to do with a seven foot gold man? Uh, I mean, you're kind of making, you, are you trying to make people feel bad for the gold man? Like, he, I mean, I, I, I would like to know if he's over there. I would prefer trees to be lost and people. I mean I that's the goat man's home though. Like how would you like it if I came into your house every like, I don't know, day and just stole a brick? I mean if it stopped a murder, I I don't think I'd mind too much. Now personally I wouldn't count these as uh, murders, I'd count it as a uh, cleansing, I'd say. Okay. You sure. Know, I think like I've explained so far in this documentary that the Gosmore locals they're they're selfish. They don't care about anyone but themselves. They're there's thieves, there's homeless, there's just disgusting, horrible people who live here, you know? And I think they deserve to be cleansed. <laughs> okay, man, calm down a little bit, alright? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just just so passionate, you know? I, I sympathize with the goat man, you know? I know what it feels like to be driven out of your home, you know? Being looked at the wrong person, you know? You, you see what I mean? Y yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, do, should we just carry on? Like, yeah, we, carry on we should probably carry on. So, we're still in the fields. We still got another about 15 minutes until we get to uh, Go Command Underbridge. Which is, I mean, it's one of my favorite like, parts of the whole thing. I got something very fucking special planned for it, John. I, what? I think you'll like it. I, I mean, you just have to wait. You just have to wait. Well, now I'm intrigued. John, is, is this like private property, you know? Or... Um, I mean... I think we can go this way. Is it really private property if we're trying to expose such a vicious animal? I mean, I guess that's, that's pretty true. Oh, hey. I didn't see you there. One of the main things that I want to talk about, about the goat man himself, is the abilities. Like I spoke earlier, he is very demonic, you know? He, he's been risen from the ground, maybe? I'm not too sure. But his abilities is what makes me credible. You know, one of the main ones is his ability to possess people, you know, physically take over their bodies. You know, it's said that once he possesses someone, some sort of uh, black vomit comes out of their mouth, and that's a sign that you should you should run. Second of his abilities is actually his scream itself. The goat man lets out this 
horrible cry. It's almost like a mating call, but it's just not as friendly to me. Um, it's so loud. Seriously, it's said to deafen people. It's said to literally rip the roots out of trees like this one here. Just up with the ground, you know? Just gone, just from a scream. So I'm actually hoping we don't hear that at all because that would just be... I don't fancy really going deaf for this. What the fuck is that? Go what? On. Get the fucking camera right now. It's a sign. Look what it says. How dare they? How dare they? No film shoot. John, you didn't tell me about this. What? what the fuck is this? Oh, what? People trying to stop the film studio? Oh. Why? Why? It's environmentally damaging. I didn't see any people living here. No. How does this affect anyone, you know? Because uh, people walk their dogs through there. But they can walk their dog through like here or here or here or here. Or they could just, you know, stick to parks where you can walk your fucking dog. Don't be ridiculous. Of course they won't do that. This is, this is, um... Come on, John. Um... Yeah, okay. Another thing about uh, the gold man in terms of his abilities is actually his um, ability to, you know, mimic voices. Now, the clever thing about this is the gold man can sound like someone you know, but he can't mimic emotion. You know, these creatures, they just can't. Emotion is too powerful for them to grasp. Even it's a human them. feeling more than a goat human feeling. Exactly. Like, Imagine your dog, imagine your dog possessing you. It wouldn't be like, hey, I'm John. You just can't do that. You just be like, hey, I'm John. You know what I mean? That kind of flat monotone. Monotone-esque vibe to it, yeah. Yes, exactly. Hey, hey, John, John, can you just like, can you just put the camera down like a little bit? Yeah. I'm just going to go put that sign up because, you know, I, people with a career are probably really passionate about, you know, not wanting to film studio. And, I mean, I've heard there's a lot of the Karens, you know? If, if they see this documentary, I, I think I'm finished. You know, so just kind of... Yeah, yeah. Just don't put this in... This won't go in the other Yeah, no, no, no. Don't, put it back yeah, up. don't worry about it. Stay there. John, you're good. Yeah, yeah, let's yeah. Go, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's so, everybody, this is where the documentary gets very interesting. If you look over here, John, I got a surprise for you. Just round this bend of this road is Goat Man's Underpass. It is a very spiritual place. We are going to be making contact with the Goat Man itself. Well, how are you going to do that? You got like some spiritual devices with you? Well, what would you class as uh, spiritual devices, John? Oh, just don't tell me you got a Ouija board. And? Candles. Well, John. Oh, we got ourselves a very own Ouija board. Oh, boy. And, John. We got ourselves some candles. I didn't realize you were a 12 year old. With some matches. Very we, good brand of matches, by the way. Not I mean, sponsored, but very good. they wouldn't be very good candles unless they were lit, would they? That is very true, John. Not but like it's going to do anything anyway, but you know. This is going to be very interesting. Okay, John? Come on, you got to act more excited than that. Come on. Yay! Come on, let's go. <laughs> just, just look how beautiful sunset. It just looks incredible. Wow. Tr truly beautiful. Don't worry, John, we're almost there. <sighs> Finally. There it is, John. Goatman's underpass. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? So, John, I, I really wanted to ask you this question. What do you think of this uh, surprise kind of ritual I've just sprung upon you? you know? What do you think of it? Um, uh, I don't know, it seems like a bit of a waste of time, but... A waste of time? Really? I... It's exciting, can you feel the adrenaline, you know? So it's a Ouija board, you know? You don't know what the fuck could happen. 
Yeah. All right. You know, no, no. I'll I'll let you take the lead and see what happens. Well, you just wait till it gets pitch black down here. We're almost there. It's sunset. You know, it's it's gonna get pretty scary. If you say so. As you can hear already, there is quite the echo down here. You know, just listen to this. It's, it's quite loud. You know, perfect for rituals. As you can see up here, all right, this is actually being recently painted because a lot of uh, demonic symbols have been all over these walls. I mean, just just pan, just look. It's incredible. Who'd want to cover up such beautiful? Objects, you know. Uh, I got my matches today, like I showed you earlier. I'm gonna try and light this up. I don't know if these matches actually work. So if they don't, then we're kind of screwed, you know. Let's try it. There you go. Up. Almost. Almost. Let's try another one. Hey. I, I think this is the one. You think I, that's I, the I one? All right, go on. Let me try the you know the other side, you know. There you go, look, it's perfect. Well, John, we're gonna have to light this canvas really fucking quick, you know. We could just not do this. I don't think that's an option, sir. I don't think that's an option. Right, so I'm thinking of, uh, if we set up the Ouija uh, board down here, see the little hatch here, right in the center, you know? and then we could do like a ring of uh, candles, and I think that'll capture the, uh, you know, the proper ritual kind of spirit. And I think if we stay within these candles, then we'll be completely fine. Sure. Fucking hell, John, why'd you buy this shit, Patrick? I didn't buy anything. Yeah, who bought it? <laughs> I didn't fucking buy it. Must have been Goat Man. Oh, there you go, there I am. Hey guys, so basically, uh, uh, John is just quickly setting up the candles. They're uh, quite difficult to light, because the matches are fucking awful. Uh, I'm just gonna try and mount this to this tripod. There you go. I'm gonna sit you guys right about here. So you're gonna get a proper view of what we're doing. Now I think I might have to make it a bit brighter because there you go, now you can see. The frame rate's a bit shitty, but I think you can see us guys and I, I'm, I'm looking forward to this. So we've got these ones on this side now. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Five more three. These matches are awful. It's a, it's a questionable circle, but I, hopefully it gets whatever job you're trying to do done, I guess. All right. Where do you want me? I want your friend set up right here. Have you uh, ever done anything like John? I don't speak to demons very often, no. You don't? Why not? Um, you know, it's just not a very common occurrence for me. Right, so uh, we've got a camera set up here, you know, a beautiful, hopefully a beautiful view. I guess we've got a John with camera behind as well. It's probably your first time seeing John, you know? Uh, so John, basically, I'm gonna have to start this uh, ritual I don't have to end it. You can't end it, you can't start it. I have to start it, okay? Yeah, sure. Uh, the rules uh, suggest that we have to be respectful. We can't, you know, curse. We, we can't say anything like that, okay? Respectful, okay. I now, what you have to do is uh, two fingers on this. Yep, that's fine. Uh, we have a yes and a no with the alphabet, uh, goodbye, and we got the numbers. Here. So, I'm going to begin this now. Are you ready, John? Sure. Are there any spirits with us right now?
Are there any spirits with us right now? I don't think it's working. John, I, I, I don't know what to tell you. Are you being too disrespectful for the demons? I mean, I feel like I'm doing everything right. I, I mean, I read the rules. The rules are right here. It can take a while for anything to happen sometimes. Ah, that's it, of course. You gotta keep trying, John. Come on, ready? Oh, yeah, great. Are there any spirits with us right now? Are there any spirits with us right now? Goldman, we would like to speak to the Goldman. Is he here? I mean, John, I, I don't know what to tell you. I, I generally place it at work. Um, yeah, but I'm... This is, I mean, pe so many people have done this. I hate to say it, I'm not, I'm not overly surprised. Why not? You know, maybe the... The candles aren't good enough, maybe... Maybe we don't have the, the, the oils, the, the salt circles, you know? Uh, I, I just don't think this is going to work. Hate to break it to you. Well, it's not the end of the world, John. You no. know why? Because we're going to the Goatman Woods next. And I, I, I got a feeling it will work there. I mean... I, I'm honestly shocked that it hasn't worked here. I mean, look at this. It's, uh, it's a piece of cardboard. Right. So, John, I think I, I think we're being too defeated too early. I think we need to try again. This time, I think we should uh, introduce ourselves. I think we should be friendly. Oh, you want to be more formalized yes. to um, the potential demons that could be exact, exactly. beyond. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Of right, course. So you can place your two fingers on the. Uh, yep. Of course. Are there any spirits with us right now? My name is Kurt Duplass, and I'm here with John Miller. Are there any spirits with us right now? I'm going to be asking one more time. Are there any spirits in this area that would wish to speak with us? Both men? Whoa, 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 did you see that? John, did you see? I looked away for one second. Did you not see the, Did you not see it, mo it moved? Was that of, you? Co of course it did. Yeah, no. Did you? Yeah, 100%. Seriously, you can't, you can't fuck around with this shit. Well, it was you, obviously. I, I, I wouldn't do shit. that. My fingers are just gently pressed. Look, it's just, it's gentle. Give us a sign. I don't, I don't think it's working, John. I'm really surprised. I mean, John, I, I don't know what to tell you. I, I, I genuinely thought it's going to work. I mean... I mean, with all that system, we could always try somewhere else. If I mean, if, I feel like Goldman's Woods would be a great place to do it. I mean, I, I've, seen, I've, I've seen and heard hundreds of stories from here about how rituals have gone very successfully here and they've seen signs of the goat man. Maybe it's all just, you know, a hoax, you know, maybe, maybe I was wrong about this place, but I, I have no doubts about goat man's woods at all. And, uh, sure. I, I feel like we should just get a move on. It's, 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 I mean, it's almost pitch black now. I just, I just can't believe it, you know, I'm, I'm a bit surprised. Well, I, I feel almost defeated. Nah, we'll you know, I'm Kurt Duplass. I get back on my feet, I know exactly what I'm doing next. You there, John? Here, ladies and gentlemen, Goldman's Woods. Finally. As you can see, you can't see anything. 
It is very dark. It is very dark. And it is going to be very scary. Yeah, you can tell. It. Jeez. Let's get a move on. Alright. Make sure to turn the brightness on that thing. Yeah, yeah. Is that okay? No, it's just it's a tree. Don't worry, John. It's just a tree. Do you know which way we're going? I mean, I see we're heading a straight, straight line. Just watch your steps there. Yeah. yeah. It's a bit chilly as well, you know. It's yeah. Summer. It's supposed to be. I mean, English weather, am I right? Ah. Uh, yeah. You're probably not used to this, are you? So I'm gonna take a little break here before we go any further. And I'm gonna show you the picture of the goat man again. Cause you know, I really gotta stress how crazy this creature is out here. And just, just look how dark it is outside. Yeah, I can barely see. So, John, make sure you got this here. We'll focus. Yeah, yeah. So as you can see, this is the clearest picture of the goat man ever recorded, you know, back in 2007. I mean, he's terrifying. Luckily, he didn't have his axe at this point. Now, I mean, if we see him nowadays and he has his axe, I I think we should just run. <laughs> I don't think we should even try and get the... I mean, I want a photo of it so badly, but I, I just don't think we can... I mean, we can it, if we're constantly filming, we're bound to get something. I mean, that's, that's the reason why I got this. Uh, I mean, look at it. There you go. It's incredible. <laughs> wow. Ready to carry on? I'm ready, John. Alright, I can do this. Yep, let's go. I can barely see like two feet in front of me now. Yeah, I'll turn the torch up. I don't even know fucking torch on. Yeah. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'll be 100% honest with you, John. I'm fucking scared right now. Yeah, it's a, very it's a bit more unsettling out here. <sighs> I mean, you still think this is a joke? Okay, it's just a bird. Never mind, never mind, never mind. We keep going. We're just gonna follow this trail because. We'll find something. Yeah, I mean, hopefully. Hopefully, civilization. Oh god, I almost fell then. I got like the shadows as well from like just the lights of the trees. Like, I, I keep thinking it's like so insane. Oh, you see the shadows moving. Wow. Feel like adrenaline? A little tingle in your balls? <laughs> so, I think we're gonna try another ritual here, you know? You know, the oven was uh, underwhelming. Disappointing. I, yeah, I mean, that's one word for it as well. Yeah. I mean, I'm already getting a very uneasy unwelcome kind of vibe from here, you know? I, I feel like it could work. I mean, John, if we just stop over here quickly. I mean, I really do believe it'll work this time. I I don't see how it can not, you know, I, like I said, I feel like that unwelcome feeling. You know when you like, enters like a stranger's house with her, someone, your, your friend's like house for the first time, you're just like, unsure of everything. Yeah, and you, you, all their family stood there staring at you, wondering who the hell you are. Exactly, and you're kind of just like... No, this is definitely... This is definitely something. I mean, my adrenaline already, and it's just so dark. I mean, just... If you... Like, I can't even see down there. Like, what is... Right. Nothing is down there. No. <laughs> anyway, let's keep going. Yeah. We've got to find a good place where we can set up this ritual. I mean... Oh, there's a second path. Uh... Okay, let's just, let's stick this one. Alright, we need an easy way to get back as well. Yeah, we gotta we got retrace our steps. Yeah, I didn't even think about I mean, we've, we've walked in a straight line so far, so... Uh, yeah, no, we, we should be fine, for the meantime. Yeah, okay. Calm down, Pat. Yeah, just don't, don't think about it. I mean, if you think about it, it's darker now as well. I feel like the lights will really just brighten the whole place up and just hopefully welcome spirits towards us, especially Goatman. And I'm feeling good about it, but I'm feeling scared at the same time, you know? 
Yeah, for well, how fast do you think you can run out of the woods? I mean, I'm not a quick guy. I, I, I will tell you that. Oh, John, do you see this? No. It looks like some sort of crater. Whoa. Um. John, get this. You got this in camera? Yeah. I'm gonna report as well. I got a giant hole. This is incredible. This is, this is actually incredible. It's, it's almost like the goat man's like nest. <laughs> um, I mean, do, do goats nest? I, I don't think so, but you know, John, he's, he's not, not your average goat. Oh. Oh, I didn't like that. That wasn't you, was it? <laughs> I'm frozen. I don't even know how to get down. Um, oh my I, I, goodness. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I didn't know if I really want to go down there just in case, you know. Did you, did you see it? Something dropped it. I don't know what it is. Yeah, no, I thought I thought you said something, but... Yeah, I, I'm just, I think I'm still thinking of it. No, it's getting darker. You can barely see anything. I just realized something. What? We've, we've lost the trail. And I hear something, but... The trail's more important. That is a good point. We were just talking about that. It's not a huge uh, woods, we'll find our way. I mean, it was somewhere that direction, but I don't know how to keep walking. We'll probably find another path. So, I think I found the perfect place for this next ritual. Uh, I'm feeling good about it. We've walked about five minutes more. And uh, as you can see up there, John's gonna zoom in. I don't know if the camera can quite pick it up. There's a tree stump. Yeah. Nothing around it, just a tree stump. I'm pretty sure. That, let's, let's go investigate, you know? Yeah, yeah. Watch our steps. Oh. Yeah, be careful because you literally can't see on the floor. Here it is. This is perfect. How is it? Look at it. Yeah. It's perfect. And it's really open around her. Maybe too open? Dun dun. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Uh, right. We'll get back to you. We're gonna set up. We're gonna do the exact same thing again. I'm feeling really good about this, but I'm also very, very scared. It'll be fine. That's just... in a second. Yeah. Please work, please work, please work. Good, 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 good. Oh. Um. Come on. Come on. You got it? Yes. Alright. There we go. Don't burn your fingers. Oh, I shouldn't have thrown that, I'm, I'm sorry. Yep. I mean, if I learned from last time, I can just light it with this. Yeah, look, look at this. Yeah, see, you're getting better at rituals. See, you, you've, you've gained something from this experience. There you go! Look at that. I'm just trying to burn the entire woods down. Yeah, no, Did I... Did you get that? Yeah, that. I'm still going for it. Now we'll be fine. It's just a tree branch falling, so... So, as you can see, Ritual number two, set up. I'm excited, John, are you excited? I'm cold. It is very cold. I know that much, but... This time, 
we've got just the uh, two candles here. Uh, one on either side, you know, spirit on either side. We're filming on this camcorder. I got my other camera down here. And uh, I'm just praying it works this time. Yes. You ready, John? Ready as I'll ever be. Two fingers on the wooden thing. Yep. And we're gonna ask if there are any spirits here, okay? Yes. Ready? Okay. Put your fingers on. Yep. My name is Kurt Duplass, and I'm with John Miller. And I'm here asking, are there any spirits with us today? My name is Kurt Duplass. This is John Miller. Are there any spirits with us? My name's Kurt Duplass, and this is John Miller. I'm going to from John. I, I can't. Man. I mean, I told you, this... <laughs> We're now in the middle of the woods. Do you know the way back? John, I... I... Oh, fuck. Eat. I don't even know what to say, you just... I was banking this to work, you know? So we spent all this time. This is a whole it's day. It's supposed to work. Well, he clearly doesn't exist, does it? It's just a wife's tale. It can't, it can't, it can't, it can't, John. I don't, I don't know what you expect me to say, it's just... I'm gonna keep recording. I'm, I'm not going home until we get anything. We need something off the goat man. What do we do now? Do we get to go home? Is that it? I, I'm, I'm not ready for that. Like I said, I'm, I'm not leaving until we've done, something happens. We've done this twice. Well, I don't want to stay out here all night for something that clearly doesn't exist. This was the perfect place. Well, clearly he doesn't exist then, because no, if it was that no, perfect... Don't, don't give me that bullshit. I, I really did think it was going to work. and I, maybe, maybe it didn't, maybe we're, we're just not seeing something, you know? I mean, nothing's moved. We're literally just, just, just let's just pack up, please. I just want to. <laughs> well, I'll get my camera. In. Goatman isn't here. That's obvious. Look, if you're so scared of him, look. Fuck you, Goatman. Come here, do John. something. John, stop, John. Well, what's he gonna do? He doesn't exist. He physically can't hurt us. John, I, you don't want to. You don't want to mess with these spirits. You don't. What spirits? There's literally nothing here. We are stood in a woods, looking at a tree stump like a bunch of idiots. Exactly. John, John I don't have a good thing about this. Please stop. Just, just Nothing. Fuck off. Yeah, go away, goat oh, man. John, come on. Do something. Come on. John. He's not here. It's obvious. Look, the Ouija board's stuck. Oh, yeah, real funny. John, no. No, real funny. John, that wasn't me. Well, it obvious. They don't just move on their wait, own, wait, do wait, they? Wait, 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 wait. I don't... Am I supposed to believe this at this point? What do you want wait, me to think? That, that wasn't you. I can, you know, I can say that wasn't you, yeah? It, you know. No, I, I don't want to be here. Yeah, that wasn't me. It wasn't... you like, paying out here to do this? Like... I know there aren't spirits here. What have you done? Like, how have you... <laughs> Come on, show me how you've rigged this up. What? You, oh, you're scared the goat man's here. John, that was me. It, I'm not this stupid. Like, can we just go home? <laughs> Fuck was that? Nah. Take it's your okay. camera. Go. Fucking with my God. Why did you bring me here? What, what was your plan? What do you mean why I bring you out here? I told you to not fuck with that ritual. Alright, just be quiet. We don't want it to... 
over here. I, st I told you not to fuck with it. Yeah. I told you that. And you started fucking cussing its name. Yeah, I know, all right. Well, what do you think was gonna happen, eh? I, I, I didn't think it was gonna happen. I, I didn't think anything was gonna happen because it didn't. Do, do I carry on filming? Yes, of course you carry on recording. What's the point? Why wouldn't you keep recording? It's the whole reason we're out here. But that's just happened. Yeah, that is on fucking camera. We need that. <sighs> Whatever. John, we got we gotta keep going. Tell me you got that on camera. I I, I think so. I I don't know. I turned my fucking camera back there. <sighs> I don't even know. Can we just leave, please? I think we should get the fuck out of here now. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> John, we gotta make sure we're not seen. If we're seen, we're fucked. Okay. Okay. Just, just watch a step. And just try to keep quiet. See anything? It's a light. I don't know. What? Oh, the what the fuck? No. <laughs> no. <coughs> what the fuck is that? Is that a hand? Is that... John, what are you doing? Come on. I want to film get, this. Get a fucking close up on me. What do you? What do you want me to say? What the fuck? Oh, get on. Grab that stick. Pull the hand back. I'm not doing that. Pull it back. <sighs> I think it's a walk dog. Oh. No, I can't. Fuck, fucking. Ah. Oh. Just take the walkie talkie, just. <sighs> no, how, how are you okay with this? If you're not just. If you're not just seeing what's happened? What, like, no, I. What do we. I, I, I don't know what we do. I, I. I what, does it work? Just, I'm, I'm gonna try it. Hello? Hello, this is uh, Kurt Duplax. Who is this? Who the fuck is this Wade? Is that you? Answer me. Wade? Who, who's Wade? I've got some Wade. I came out here hunting with him. Please. Oh, no, no. I can't. I can't. No. I can't. <sighs> uh, do you recall when you last saw him? Still here. Uh, oh, fuck. We'll we'll try and guide you, okay? We we'll try and we'll try. In this woods, you need to get me the fuck out of here now. I think I just cut him off. I yeah. Sorry, I, I I cut you off. Can you can you say that again? Can you repeat that again? Something is in this woods. I don't know what the fuck it is. It was chasing me and my cousin. I'm not some of the trail. What's in this fucking woods? John, what the fuck have we done? Why are we done? You fucked him. This isn't me. This is my fault. You can't believe you're the one who dragged me here to do this. You've... You've... Oh my, I don't even know. 
Can I can I ask you what your your name is, please? My name is Travis. Okay. Here's what's gonna happen. I'm with my camera and John. We we got some torches. We're gonna put them full blast, and you tell me if you see them. Okay. 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 I'll go to this. Okay. Here we go. John. Full blast. Yeah. You see them? Which direction? I'm away, I'm away. What the fuck is this? I don't even know what direction. What the fuck? Let me see him. What do we tell him? Yeah, Travis, we're still here. Can you still see oh the torches? Oh my god. Yeah, I can, I can. But very far. Travis, do you have a, a torch on you? Okay, good, good. Keep just keep moving. John, I, I, I think we gotta get rid of that. He can if if he comes here and he sees that, we're fucked. Well what do we tell him? Hey, hey. Remind me of your name again. Oh no. I I'm my name's Kurt. Um I'm also here with my friend uh John. Yeah, no, no problem, Travis. Uh, we we haven't seen any any Wade, any any other person. You're the first person we've seen in this woods today, tonight, should I say? So it's okay. We'll we'll, we'll find them. We'll we'll, we'll we'll help you. You know. We don't know if he's dead. He might be alive. Just his fucking hands on I, I don't know. I could have just Yeah, I know. We can't we can't we're not taking it. Leave it alone, just leave it, please. The blood looks quite dry, you know. It, I I mean, that's if he still survived that. He probably bled out by now, you know? <laughs> He's just a kid. What do we What do we say? John, can you oh, fuck out of it? What? Travis? You, you there? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. What, 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 what's going on? W what did you just say over the radio just beforehand? Are you right over there? I, I, didn't, I didn't say anything. We heard a, 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 a voice, and it's, it's, I mean. Would he sound like you? But we heard a voice over the the walkie-talkie. That wasn't you. Look, I'm just gonna keep moving. Okay. Oh, fuck. Do we move? Do we move a bit away from it? Yeah. Right. If we move, then Travis can't find us. No, I literally mean if we just move to another tree. Uh, Travis, can I just ask you a quick question? Sure. Your, uh, cousin Wade, um, how old did you say he was again? No, he's only 13, turning 40. And when was the, the last time you saw him? Okay, Travis, uh, did you get a look at this, uh, this creature? Did you hear anything? No, I didn't see a fucking thing. I just bowled like any normal fucking person. Alright, John, it's quite, it's good. Okay, we're, we're getting out of here. Just need to... Uh... They probably stopped chasing us and killed a kid. Oh my... So, Travis, you said you're, uh, you're off trail? Uh... So basically, what's going to happen is, do you have a torch in you? Yes, yes, I have a torch. I already told you. Okay. 
Okay, we're gonna turn our lights off, and I know that would be scary, that'd be scary, but we need you to turn your torch on and shine it up in the sky, okay? Watch on, turn it yeah. Try to Yeah, uh, we can see, we can see, Try to turn, you're not too far now. We're gonna turn ours back on now, okay? But he's not too far. Okay, what do we do? Should we head to him? Well, we stay here. You sure? But we know where he is. We might as well just. I don't know who he is. Okay, yeah, Jerry's just got quiet. I don't know what to say to him. <laughs> I can't. We, if he gets here and he sees a hand, he's he's gonna be in bits, and he's gonna fucking attract this the, the goat man. Here. What, what, what do you want me to do? What do you want us to do? We can't okay. touch. Push it over. I'm not picking it up. What the fuck was that? <laughs> nah. Are we on the right channel? We have. To. No, no. What was that? John. Remember earlier when I was, uh... I was talking about the goat man's abilities? Yeah, like, super strength um, and all that, and he could... Um, he could mimic voices. You're not... No. Have we just been talking? Travis, are you there? I, I hate to ask this question again, but that wasn't you on the radio a minute ago, was it? What the fuck are you talking about? You know, I don't need this right now. Okay, Travis, just just calm down. We just maybe there's someone else on this channel, you know, you know, interfering. Uh, we're just filming a, a documentary on the, uh, the the local town, you know. <sighs> right. Whatever. Right. I, I appreciate your help. I'm sorry for. I'm sorry, just a bit rude. No, I, I I completely understand this. Just just keep going. What the fuck is this? Oh, it's, it's our fault. This kid's dead. Or what do you mean? On. Well, we clearly... We, How the fuck's it off? We're the ones who, like, bought in here, didn't we? Isn't that what we were doing with the, the candles and the Ouija board? I didn't think you'd kill a kid. He's 13. <laughs> Travis, are you, are you still there? How, how far do you think you are? Okay, keep moving. Can we stay here for five minutes? I don't know. I don't, I don't feel safe. We are stood in the middle of nowhere, in an empty bit of a forest, which we're standing next to a potentially dead child's hand. I mean, I feel the same way, but if we move, it puts more distance between us and Travis. If it even is Travis, like, what, what, we don't know who this guy is, and we're just leading him here, whilst we I know. I don't know what the fuck that was on the radio. I don't know. That was a different voice, wasn't it? It could have just been some kid tuning into the local, like, frequency and then just messing with us. I don't know. There's a lot of houses around here. It could have just been anything. I don't know. Just leave it alone, please. It, oh, I can't. I'm not touching that thing. We're we're leaving it there. It is staying. We're not moving it or anything. I'm gonna sound like a bit of a dick right now. But make sure you keep recording. What? Travis? Would you say sorry? Never mind, I'm just I'm just being paranoid. 
Did you say someone's watching us? This guy's following oh, yeah. this. Is... Nah, I don't. I don't like this guy. No. I can't even see that part. Is, is this guy like bipolar? He's in fucking. He's in shock. His fucking thirteen-year-old cousin is just gone. We found his fucking head. Yeah, but he's just gone. Someone's watching you. Turn your torches off, and then just gone. Oh wait, never mind. Who would? Is he warning us? Is he threatening us? Travis, you're not gonna die, just keep moving. Just trust your instincts, you know? Oh my Jesus. Damn, it's fucking light. What was that? What was that? Travis, we heard it too. Are you okay? That was no, it. No, 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 no. Did you hear that? Yes. We, we fucking heard that. That was not too close. Travis, you're, you're gonna have to use a torch. If, if you can't see. That was not human. What the fuck? My legs are like fucking jelly, mate. I can barely walk. You just gotta keep moving. John. We, we could have left by now. We can't stay here. We, we you're right. You're, I agree. Why do, why do we have to find this radio? We could have just gone. Do we just leave? What's it? Travis, we're gonna have to move, okay? <sighs> do what you gotta do. Alright, yeah, okay, let's go. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. This is fucked. Do you know the way back from here? I, I think we should just pick a direction. Hope we hit a I thought I heard something. What? But we can't just stand it. Travis, how's looking? Oh, wait, oh, okay, I can see you guys. Two torches, that's it, that's you. You can hear us. You you see us? Which, which direction are you coming from? Which, which way are you coming from? On your side, I think. My right or my, my left? Your left. I don't like this. I really don't like this. Because if he can see us, who knows who else can? Don't fucking see that. I'm not messing with that. Travis, can you hurry up now, please? No, just, just run. He's fucking dead. Yeah, I fucking assume so, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit.
Can you hear that? I, I, I think it's some cars in here. I, I think we're just going to be free. <laughs> yeah, well, I finally, we've been running for hours. <laughs> what was going on back there? Like, we were literally being chased by a giant goat man. What? How are you so calm no, about no, this? I just want to get the fuck out of here. We'll carry on then. If you want to. Whoa, 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 wait a second. What? We need to go. Where the fuck's my camera? I don't care about your camera. No, well, I, I do. I don't. We. We gotta go. We gotta I go don't back. care. We're going. No. That's a 500 pound camera. Leave. Go. Ah, oh, fuck things. Don't have to I don't. I don't care about your footage or camera. I want to go home. Oh. I have to put it in my camera. I. What a shame, I want to get out of here alive. What? Why are we stopping? You know this morning, when I was, I was talking to the audience about the locations we're going to? Y yes, the places this we is, went. This is, this is Goldman's Tunnels. Why have you brought us here? This is the most... We're literally in some place that he's known for coming to, as we're trying to get away from him. Do, do you realise how stupid that is? Literally 60% of the signs have been here. What? Hundreds of people Can we are walk missing. around it? I, do, you, do you see a way we can walk around this? <sighs> can we just get it over and done with? Please. This is crazy. This is crazy. Well, yeah, no kidding, it's crazy. We've been chased by a demonic goat. Okay, we need to be quiet. Yeah, we, we can't go in there. John, we need to move quickly. Where do we go? Where why are we staying here? Why is there so much glass on the I, I don't want to know. Alright, let's just get the fuck out of here right now. Yeah, yeah. Sorry if you're Hopefully we lost him in the woods. This is crazy. Why, why are we still here? Oh, we're going to keep going. Like, why do I agree we'll, we'll to get, do this? We'll get home. I, th I think I see some, some lights at the end. Yeah. Okay, I'm sure. That's... We might have to go down to the end of this. I know it's going to be scary, but I think it's the only way out. It's our best option, I guess. I t I'm not going to... Feel that it's, it's getting colder. Why the hell are you staying here? We need to go. Hurry the hell up, man. What I'm are you doing? I'm no, running. I don't have time for this. We need to go. It's not going to burn. Just leave the ball. We don't need to do this. We don't need to do this. Cut. Cut, where the hell are you? Be in this tunnel all night. Oh, man. 
You okay? You okay? Or are you good? What's up? What's happened? You <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, what happened? Are you okay? Oh my god. Cut you. Come on, come on, man. We need, to, we need to go home. Fine, man. We're not too far from the lights now. Oh, Cut. Are you, are you good? That was. I don't even know. Sure, man. Take that as a yes. Look, the house is. Oh, we're so close. What the fuck are you doing? What? What? Not nice rock, I guess. What? What are you doing? Are you good? Cut. Okay, if you made it this far, then well done, because that is a tough watch. Okay, so I found this, uh, this news report on the two missing lads. Let me just show you. So yeah, this is a news article from a couple of months ago. Um, and yeah, that's uh, that's Kurt, I think his name was. And his, his video production company, uh, Video Production News. I was looking for like a YouTube channel. I found one, it's got like one subscriber, but it's no videos or anything. It's like, this must have been like his first big project or something, I don't know. I mean, he seemed very ambitious, and if you, if you watched it, I mean, yeah. There are states here that many people have gone missing over the years, and it's almost like, I mean, yeah, what can the police do, I mean, with a seven-foot mythical creature, you know? It states here that, that they have warned people to not try and contact this creature, you know? It's like they know it's real, and just what can they, what can they do? They didn't actually see or capture the goat man on camera but the stuff they heard was just terrifying to say the least and yeah I mean the person on the walkie talkie like was that the goat man the whole time because you know he said he can mimic voices so, I mean you, you, just, you just don't know actually his um, ability to you know mimic voices now the clever thing about this is the goat man can sound like someone you know but he can't mimic emotion. And they found a human hand. That's a, that's a young teen, practically a child's hand. That's, that's fucked. That's, that's crazy. I just can't wrap my head around it. I mean, th this is my responsibility now. Here is the camera and the camcorder. I just wanted to show you guys. Uh, like I said before, these don't actually work at all. Which I find strange because there's not really any... Act there's not actual damage to them. I don't know, it's odd. 
Maybe they just shut down. See, it's got a it's got a road mic on it too. This is the one that they lost back in the woods that they left behind. Most of the footage was actually filmed on the camcorder. I, w I wish I could just speak to the person who was selling these cameras. Like, where did he find them? He obviously didn't check them. I can't remember his face. Like, oh. I wish I never picked up these fucking cameras, man. I've heard about the goat man all my life, really, but it's a, it's an urban legend in, in our town of Gosmore. Like, I mean, I, I never thought it was the goat man was that deadly, you know. You, you could tell he literally possessed Kurt in the in the footage. He, he he it's like he physically took over his body, you know, causing him to kill his his cameraman John. Like, it's it's insane. You could he, he was coughing up blood. I don't know, was it was it him snapping the Ouija board that, that it triggered him to get possessed or Yes, we don't need to do this. <sighs> the goat man, you know, just wanted to drag it out and he, he could have possessed them at any time, but just wanted to scare them as much as he could first. Goat man, you evil bastard, if you're watching this, go fuck yourself. Okay, so I just found out that the uh the goat man tunnel is uh Actually, just a few miles from where I live, so I'm gonna head down there uh, while it's still light. Get some footage. Um, I'm not gonna go there at night. I'm not that insane. Um, let's just check the place out. We could find something. I don't know. Let's do this. So, uh, I just got a lift here to, uh, well, I think it is Goatman's Tunnel. Let's check this place out. You can, you can tell they've tried blocking it off, but that clearly hasn't worked. So they must have come, it was this tunnel where all of it took place and he obviously came through here and went out that way onto the field and that's where the uh that's where shit got disturbed. I think it was a good choice to come out in the daytime and not make the same mistake that they did. Like you can you can hear the cars, so they were it makes it even sadder that they they were so close to you know making it. I feel kinda of bad. This is probably where that son of a bitch was stalking them, you know. You know, it's almost like it's almost like the go man was you know Teasing them, and he wasn't attacking you right right away. He, wanted, he wants to scare them, you know. Feeds off their fit. Just imagine how terrifying it would have been, you know, being here at night, you know, being in their shoes. I can't imagine. Probably gonna head back now, you know. Uh, like I say, there's not much here, but. This is the closest place to me. I don't think I want to check out the other places. Right. 
This is the second time I've woken up. Oh, I keep hearing shit outside. There's some shady shit going on. Most likely because I'm paranoid as fuck right now. If I wake up once more, I'm, I'm fucking going out there. This is staying closed. It's literally quarter past three in the morning. The devil's hour, so they call it. It sounds almost like I have like wooden fences in my house. It sounds like something scratching against the wood, if you know what I mean. That awful like sound. Kill me now. I've been sat here for like seven, eight minutes debating whether to fucking go outside and just check what the fuck's going on. <sighs> Let's do this. I, I need to get this all out of my fucking brain. I, I need sleep, man. Like, <sighs> I'm filming because why not? I've got nothing better to do. Thank you. 